Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. Today is day 24. Wow. 60% done. Only 16 more days to go. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. And I hope we've, uh, we've been fasting and we've been praying. I really hope we've been fasting and we've been praying. I know it's easier to fast in this period because uh, the, other, the, <laughs> the majority of uh, the people in the country are actually fasting at the moment, so there will be not too many distractions as regards uh, food and water. But I hope we are praying because if we're not praying, uh, we're not getting the best out of it, really. We're not getting the best out of it. It's only a medical fast or it's good for our body, but we want something that is good also for our soul, for our spirit. So I'll keep encouraging us that we continue to do that, that we fast and we pray. Uh, in fact, there are, there, I remember that there is a part in the Bible where Jesus' disciples were trying to cast out demons and they couldn't do it. They were able to do other things. They sent it out two by two before then. But when it got to this point, they couldn't do that. And when Jesus came back, he said, uh, you can't do this one yet. This, this kind can only you know, be done by fasting and prayers. So you can see that there is a superior level of, of response and answers that you get when you fast and pray. So let's key into this moment and do it. Because some of us will not even do it for ourselves personally until we call it cooperating like this. So let's you know, be encouraged to continue to press on and fast and pray. I pray that the grace to not be tired, to not get weary. The Lord multiply to us in Jesus' name. And so let's begin to worship the name of the Lord. Let's begin to give him all the glory. Let us begin to worship him, to bless him, to give, his, to give him all the glory that he deserves. To give him all of the honor, all of the accolade, all of the, all, all of the reverence that he deserves. Begin to give God all the reverence. That he, call him those sweet names. Begin to remind yourself now of how mighty he has been in your life. Remind yourself of how mighty, how powerful he has been for you. Remind yourself now of how faithful he has been. Begin to bless the name of the Lord. Begin to exalt his name. Begin to worship him. Begin to, uh, begin to worship him. Begin to praise his name. <coughs> begin to praise the name of the Lord. Worship him. Give him all the glory. Return all honor to him. I'm not hearing us pray. Begin to worship the Lord. Worship him in truth. And his, his spirit and in truth. Worship him. Give him all the glory. Return all honor to him. Return all adorations to him. Only him deserves all the glory. Only him deserves all the praise. Only him deserves all the honor. Only him deserves all the worship. Father, we give you glory. We give you worship. We exalt you. We adore you. Over everyone. Over this house, oh Lord. Over this church, we say thank you. Over every member, all of us say thank you. Over everyone, every leader, every, every man, every woman. Over every child, we say thank you, Father. For you've been so faithful to us. We give you glory. We give you honor. We give you adorations, Lord. We worship you, Heavenly Father. We return all glory to you. <coughs> all honor to your name, Heavenly Father. We worship you. Take all the glory, Lord. Take all the honor. Take all adorations. Lord, we worship you. We give you all glory. We adore you. Oh, Lord, we adore you. We know, oh Lord, we are aware of how mighty you have been amidst. We say thank you, Father. We worship you. We've come to bow at your feet. We've come to bow before your throne. We've come to worship you. Oh Lord, we are not taking this for granted. We are not just commonizing because we do it every day as a routine. No, it's not really routine, Lord. We remind ourselves of how mighty you have been. From the beginning of the year, you have been so mighty for us. Oh Lord, we say thank you. We worship you. A lot has happened, oh Lord. Even in the space of the last two and a half months or three months, oh Lord, a lot has happened. But you have been so true. You have been so faithful. You have been so kind. You have been so loving. There is none like you. Father, we say thank you. We exalt you. We worship your holy name. Paradia Basonia Rai Kappa. Likeme Tokipaya. Farakino Maikota. Lika Patometa Kataya. 
Barra sole tai katoya, reketome tai toya. Lord, we worship you. We return all glory, all honor, all adorations to you, all reverence, Lord. We bow before your throne. We lay it all down, casting all crowns aside. Casting all crowns aside, O oh Lord. We worship you. You are the only king in the room. There is none like you. Only king in the room. There is none in your class. We worship you, Lord. Oh Lord, we worship you. Oh, men may have worshipped us. Men may have given us some of the glory. But we've come to return them all back to you. And in the the one that you can never question, there is none like you. We worship you. From the depth of our heart, from the depth of our heart, oh Lord, we know, we know and we worship you. We see your value, Lord. We see how mighty you are in our midst. We see how great you are to us. We see how faithful you have been. Father, we worship you. Father, we exalt you. Lord, we glorify you. Take all honor. Receive our worship, O oh Lord. Receive our worship. Father, take all the glory. Take all the glory. Take all the glory. Father, we do not commonize this, O oh Lord. We do not just commonize this. We worship you. Thank you for how mighty you are. For how great you are. For how, how, how loving you are, Lord. How merciful you are. Father, thank you. Father, thank you. For even giving us the grace, O oh Lord, to become sons to you. For the adoption, for the sonship that we enjoy. For the grace that we call you Father. Father, we say thank you. Lord, thank you. We give you worship. We return all honor, all honor, all adorations to you. All glory, all honor, all reverence to you, Lord. We worship you, Lord, for all that you have done. We say thank you. We glorify you, Lord. Over our health, we say thank you. Over our health, we say thank you. Over our lives, we say thank you. Over our body system, we say thank you. Over all that concerns us, we say thank you. We give you worship. We give you reverence. We give you adorations. Parodia bakiale mani yate kome daivato matera de basolida yaka patika rudaka rekete pele baitoya mate kote kata rakoto peleta kito maika marando siavato likome laikara yere yadoratia aparodia sulaiate Lord we worship. We give you glory. For this church, I thank you. For every member, I say thank you, Heavenly Father. I give you glory, Lord. For the land, I say thank you. For the peace we enjoy, I say thank you. For the peace in the land, I say thank you, Lord. We worship you. It is not just by our own human wisdom. It is not just by our human deeds and dreams. It is by you. It is you. For the peace in the land. Because we are not even running at Tasketa. We are not even worried for our safety. Lord, we thank you. Take all the glory, Father. Take all of our worship. Receive our worship, Lord. Receive our worship. Receive the honor, Lord. Receive the honor, Lord. Receive the honor, Lord. Receive the honor, Lord. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Let us begin to receive the mercy of God. Begin to receive the mercy of God. Avail the mercy of God now. Begin to receive the mercy of God. Begin to receive the mercy of God. Say, Father, I receive your mercy. I receive your mercy. I, I appropriate your mercy, Lord. I receive your mercy, Lord. I receive your mercy, Lord. For every hero, for every uh, uh, everything that every even in the areas I know what to do, but I fail to do them. Even when you know what good to do, but you fail to do them. Receive the mercy of the Lord now. Father, I receive your mercy. I receive your mercy. Father, I receive your mercy. 
Father, I receive you. I obtain your mercy, Lord. Your mercy to pray and write, Lord. I receive your mercy. Father, I receive your mercy. I do not want to just do it on my own, oh Lord. I do not just want to live on my own. I don't want to lean on my faithfulness. I don't want to lean on my righteousness. I just, oh Lord, I receive your mercy. Father, I receive your mercy. Oh, Father, I receive your mercy. Father, I receive your mercy. I receive your mercy, Lord. I receive your mercy, Lord. Father, I receive your mercy. I begin to pray that God's Spirit be heavy in the house tonight. That His Spirit be heavy in the house. His might, His glory be heavy in the house tonight. In the name of Jesus. Father, I pray that your glory be heavy in the house tonight. That your glory, O oh Lord, your manifold glory, O oh Lord, let it be presented tonight. Father, you will to express you in all that we do tonight, oh Lord. In all, for every one that will minister, oh Lord, that you speak to us expressly, Heavenly Father, that your glory, the weight of your glory, that the weight of your glory, Lord, Barasolia Badakaya, Kelania Maradia Toka, Inga Radia Basoliga, Redefena, my copa. Perania Makotia Kaya, Likata Pacatomia, Irakete Pelemento, Likoto Parsadia, Rakata Kude by Kata, Zukete Mai Kaya, Roke Levane Mai Tora, Erakata Pacute, Likete Parandias, Zute Mantia Kaya, Gerandosia Vato, Gerandosia Pai, Peke Tume Laikota, that is. There is koinonia with everybody personally. Keta Rudia Bataika, Yate Matopalia, that none will live empty. Paradia Bataika, Liko Pete Kapaya, Karudia Batiakate, Reketome of Yapaya, I said, none will live empty in the mighty name of Jesus. Paras Kule Daikato, Yete Kapate Kataya, Rokete Mene Vaitako. Lika to palia vara, rekete pelemen, yi to paia, ki to paia, aiko to paso niadaraya, rati palia batota, in the name of Jesus. Lita kapadia barutakaya, that we have personal encounter with you. Tonight, Lord, that we have personal encounter with you. Lika palia da soniata, erakete mantiaka, laki paru di atapa. You know exactly what we need, O oh Lord. That we have personal encounter with you. In the name of Jesus. That we have personal encounter. Personal koinonia with you. Paria dosia palia. Yete palia katapal. Rete kete kepayana. Rote sone mantiaka. Lika patome ataikato. Yete pira diadaso. Reke te pele me kotiaka. Irake te palos. Zito piatai. Baru Saivata, in the name of Jesus. For in Jesus' name we are prayed. Amen. 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 I want us to talk very quickly this night about something, a very simple topic. It's the simple topic wisdom. That one we'll talk about tonight. Very simple, but very powerful wisdom and the focus will be slightly more on the skillful wisdom but wisdom first let's 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 try to understand where wisdom comes from is it on account of how much we are able to press how much we're able to read by ourselves or how much we're able to apply ourselves or the opportunity we have let's see where it comes from i will put to the book of um exodus chapter 28 please Exodus 28, verse 3. And thou shalt speak unto all that are wise at it. This, this is God speaking. God speaking to Moses. And thou shalt speak unto all that are wise at it. Whom I have filled with the spirit of wisdom. Can you see that? Whom I have filled with the spirit of wisdom, that they may make Aaron's garments to consecrate him, that he may minister unto me in the priest's office. 
quickly let's 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 also check uh, something similar to that in um exodus 31 from verse 1 to 6. exodus 31. yeah another one here and and the lord speaks unto moses saying go on please see i have called by name bezalel the son of uri the son of all of the tribe of judah go on please and i have filled him with the spirit of god you see you see you see you see what is responsible for wisdom the spirit of god in wisdom and in understanding and in knowledge and in all manners of workmanship verse 4 please to devise cunning works to walk in gold and in silver and in brass verse 5 and in cutting of stones to set them and in carving of timber to walk in all manner of workmanship verse 6 please and I behold I have given I have given with him a holy app, the son of Ab Ahi Shamak of the tribe of Dan and in the arts of all that are wise hearted I have put wisdom that they may make all that I have commanded thee see and in all the arts of sorry and in the arts of all that are wise hearted I have put wisdom so when you see a man that is wise hearted who has put the wisdom there God you see what we see as skilled and talented people it's God that is God that actually put it there and what do we do with it normally if you go to ver if you go to Proverbs 18 verse 16 verse 15 to 16 16 mainly Proverbs 18 16 Very common verse a man's gift maketh room for him and bring it in before great men this is the purpose of the wisdom the purpose of the gifts that you get this is the purpose that it will make room for you in the end what should give you all that you will need what god has given you if you leave this and if we if we now examine now that we know where wisdom comes from let's look at how we can increase it and how we can multiply what god has given to us we'll see that from the book of matthew matthew 25 from matthew 25 it's supposed to be a long read but i'm just going to focus on verse 29 <laughs> We all know this story let me i'll just give you a little bit of background there this is a story of the parables that the parable that jesus told about um a man that was traveling that gave um talents to his servants he, to one he gave five to one he gave two to the other to the last he gave one now we all know what they did what they all did with it the five multiplied it to become ten they had to become extra five and ten and then the two made it into four and then the one decided to go bury it and brought it back to the wicked master now look at this part that, is, that I find very interesting. That he said, "For to everyone who asks, more will be given, and he who have abundance, and he will have abundance." Rather, sorry, can we have it amplified? Okay. Said, for to everyone who has will more be given and he will be furnished richly so that he will have an abundance but from the one who does not have even what he does not have will be taken away that is for the one who is not productive with what he has So just give me a second. I want to. Um, there is a. In the 
the new amplifier there's a way there's a way to put there It says yes, for to everyone who has and values his blessings and gifts from God and has used them wisely. You can see the way it's put there. And has used them wisely. So it is one thing to value that blessing first. Give uh, and then use them wisely. More will be given. And it will be richly supplied so that it will have an abundance. But from the one who does not have because he has ignored and or disregarded his blessings and gifts from God. Even what he does have will be taken away from him. See? Simply, simply put, for you to have more in terms of wisdom from God, in terms of gifts from God, what you need to do is to properly number one identify what you have you must first identify it because if you don't even know what you have you can't even know how best to use it identify it then after identifying it you also have to what refine it you have to put in the work to refine it after refining it then you have to put it to use you have to put it to use and with all of your heart with all diligence and after putting it to use as well there is the last thing that you have to do you have to use it for the kingdom you have to use it for the kingdom in accordance with the will of god with this let's 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 go into prayers we'll both pray only a few prayer points first we'll ask for mercy for the first prayer will be a prayer of mercy a prayer of mercy father have mercy on me i receive your mercy in every area oh lord for any of my any of the gifts you have given to me that I have not put to use in the manner that you want, that I have not put to use in the manner that you you, you will and propose for my life. Father, have mercy. I receive mercy. Father, I receive mercy. For any of any gift, any deposit you have in my life that I have failed to use, I have failed to, I have failed to refine, I have failed to even identify them. Lord, have mercy on me. Father, have mercy on me. Father, I receive your mercy. Lord, I receive your mercy. I receive your mercy, Lord. For all the wasted years, I receive your mercy. The lives I should have touched, I have not touched them. Lord, I receive your mercy. With that gift you have given to me, those, those lives that I should have touched, the, the areas, the territories I should have taken for you, I have not done those things, Lord. Have mercy on me. I receive your mercy. Father, I receive your mercy. Father, I receive your mercy for any area, any area, oh Lord, that any any area that I have I've been wasting away, oh Lord, in any area of my life that you have deposited something, but I've not put it to good use. Father, have mercy on me. Father, I receive your mercy. Lord, I receive your mercy. Father, I receive your mercy. Mercy from above, oh Lord. I receive your mercy, oh Lord. I receive your mercy, oh Lord. Father, I receive your mercy, O oh Lord. Now begin to pray, O oh Lord. Begin to pray now that God opens your eyes. Opens the eyes of your understanding. That you begin to identify all that God has deposited into you. That all that he has deposited into you, that you begin to you begin to identify them. Father, I receive, O oh Lord, sight, O oh Lord. Sight, O oh Lord, to actually see, to actually know all that you have deposited in me. All that you have given to me, O oh Lord. All of the potentials that you have already, that you have deposited in, the, in me, O oh Lord. Father, I receive sight, O oh Lord. I receive sight to identify them. I receive sight to identify them. In the mighty name of Jesus. I receive sight to identify them, O oh Lord. Baba, I receive sight to identify them. Anywhere that they may have been hidden before. Anywhere that they may have been hidden before. That I receive sight to oh identify them, Lord. I identify them all. In the mighty name of Jesus. I identify them. Every of the gifts you have given to me. Every of the gifts you have given to me, O oh Lord. I receive gifts to identify them. Every skillful wisdom you have given to me. Every skillful wisdom you have given to me. Lord, I receive the sight, O oh Lord, to identify them. I receive the sight to identify them, O oh Lord. I receive the sight to identify them. In the mighty name of Jesus, I receive discernment, discernment spirit to identify them, to actually know them, to actually become aware of them. 
I receive the grace, O oh Lord, to identify them. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I receive it, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. I begin to identify them all. You begin to show me my spiritual scorecard. Everything you show me in fullness. Who I am in you. All that you have proposed in me. All that you have proposed in me. That I begin to identify them now. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I receive your help, O Lord. Your help, O Lord. To make perfect use, to be productive with all the gifts you have given to me. To make perfect use of them. Father, I receive your help, O Lord. Help from above, O Lord. Help from above, O Lord. I receive your help, O Lord. Father, I receive your help. Father, I receive your help. Your help, O Lord, to make adequate use, O Lord, of all that you have proposed for me. All that you have, you have deposited into me. Father, I receive your help, O Lord. I receive your help, Heavenly Father. Your help, O oh Lord. Father, I receive your help, O oh Lord. By your help, O oh Lord, I am productive with all that you have given to me. I am adequately productive with all that you have given to me, O oh Lord. That I am able to multiply them, O oh Lord. I am able to be productive with them. I am able to make impact with them. My life makes impact with them. With all that you are deposited to me. I receive grace. I receive help from above. Lord, for all that you are deposited to me. I receive, oh Lord, grace and help from above, oh Lord. To fully adequate and adequately use them. To utilize them for your glory. To apply them properly, oh Lord. I receive grace, oh Lord. I receive your help, oh Lord. Father, I receive your help, oh Lord. La temantia baikata. La rida taikopa. Zaito mate yaikaileta. Lika ta rida basa. Yata mako maita pariate. La randia maitopa. Lika randia baitosa. Lete maika paro di adarzosa. Yete paiko lataya. Rakatame la isonane. Yava rude by taco. Lika patapano my castle. In the name of Jesus. Every unique gift you've blessed me with, O oh Lord. I receive it from above. To adequately be productive with them. I receive grace to be productive. Grace to have results. Grace to have results. Without results. In fact, people without God in your life. Grace, O oh Lord, to have results. Baba, grace to have results. To be productive with all that you have deposited in me. Grace to have results. Grace to make impact. You are not put on this earth just to exist. You are here to make impact. You are here to leave your mark. In the name of Jesus. Father, I receive help from above. Help to maximize all that you have deposited into me. To maximize all that you have deposited into me. To maximize them all, O Lord. To maximize them according to your will for my life. According to your plan and purpose for placing me on this earth. Kate paya kaila. Rako some taivato. Lira dia baita paya. Mete meko my rosa. Lira dia my kota. Vara dia basuneta. In the name of Jesus. I receive, O oh Lord, help from above to do the right thing at the right time. To, in order to perfect all that you have given to me and to use them to be productive with them for kingdom come to be productive with them for kingdom come for your kingdom oh lord kalia balatia yate raso kele my vate parina my katoya in the name of jesus talima itaparu saidaka ya katome lai kopa rate kete paliaka shada by taco Yatra Mako my taruta Lika Patome Daikasa Father I receive help from above O Lord 
I receive help from above, O oh Lord. Let hunger for hunger for resort burn in me. Let me not set it for mediocre life, O oh Lord. Hunger for hunger for more, O oh Lord. Hunger for that, that life, that impactful life you already set for me. And I begin, O oh Lord, I begin to refine every gift you've given to me to good, and I begin to put them to good use. I begin to put them to good use. For the for your glory, Lord, for the glory of your name. I begin to put them to good use, O oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. After this, my life will not remain the same. After this, my level of impact will not remain the same. After this, my level of result will not remain the same. In the mighty name of Jesus. I will not just live empty. I will not just live empty. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I receive help from above. Talia Baikatai. Kete Maiko Pariate. Liko te paliaso. Yate kale my tariate. In the name of Jesus. I receive help from above. Help to live an impactful life. With all that you have deposited to me. With all the gifts you have given to me, O Lord. With all the skillful wisdom you have blessed me with. With the skillful wisdom that you have blessed me with, O Lord. I receive help to make impact. Help to make the right impact. Help to make kingdom impact. In accordance to your will for my life. Oh Father, I receive your help. To not settle for mediocre life. That I will not just settle for mediocre life. That I will get to the place of where, where kings and princes where they, are, they will be my audience. Where kings and princes will be my audience. Where captains of industries will be my audience. We, just with that gift you have given to me, Lord. With that skillful wisdom you have blessed me with. If you have the Holy Spirit of God, you already have skillful wisdom. The spirit of wisdom is already in you. You only need to refine and activate all that he has already deposited into you. In the name of Jesus, I receive help from above. I receive help from above. In the name of Jesus, I receive help from above. Help from above to make impact. In accordance with your will for my life. In accordance with your purpose for me. In accordance for your, with your purpose for me on earth. I receive grace and help, O Lord, to make impact. To make impact, rightful impact. In the exact manner they have ordained it. In the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Put your hands together for Jesus. Clap for Jesus. Clap for Jesus. 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 Revelation chapter 3, verse 7. Revelation chapter 3, verse 7. Jesus. Please can we read it together? And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia, write this thing. Say, he is holy, he is truth, he was the key of it. Shut no, no one open. Jesus. Tell somebody whatever God has promised you shall come to pass. Jesus. Say it one more time. Jesus. Jesus' name. Jesus. Just be in the mood of worship. Just be in the mood of worship. Jesus. You are no the man. No. You are not a man, no. You are a God who opens door, no man can shut. You are not a man, no. You are not a man, no. You are the God of everything, no one like you. You are not a man, no. You are not a man, no. 
You are a God who opens door, no man can shut. You are not a man, oh. You are not a man, oh. You are the God of everything, no one like you. Oh. No one like you, Jesus. No one like you. Hey, no one like you. Who is it? No one like you. No one like you. No one like you. I'm a father. No one like you. We are star. You are the God of every. No one like you, oh Jesus, no one like you, no one like you, you say, no one like you, no one like you say, no one like you, I'm a father, no one like you, we are a star, you are the God.
is the Lamb of God. He is the Lamb of God who sleeps upon the throne. He alone is worthy of our praise. He alone is worthy of our praise. Kados, 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 kados.
lifted up your voice. Hallelujah. Lift up your voice and bless the name of the Lord. Lift up your voice and bless the name of the Lord. Lord, we worship your King. We salute your supremacy, Lord. Hey! Lord, we bow before your throne, Lord. Shale para sumele kope la taya, tara kigo preneta vranis. Shali para bete me la gabana, tora diska. Shale me la bete me la tara tatias. Kaboro peto bele me ratanis. Tamalias, and Kronoto Beretia Tabas, Iradibo Shanata La Gradiske Zenit, Mako Perataris, Irabo Shanemela Talabara Daga de Gatelanis, Embrano Shatapario Coberatalis, Asobera Batia Mamaraba Ila Teres, Ay, 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 ay. Shabaria coberata maladies, Angrano Satila, Rifa to Pratele Gabarada, Erabosana Matia Beregatolabes, Asa Pratuka Paratelius. Worship him in words, in tongues, however. Say something. Ha <laughs> ha. Aye. Aye. Ha ha ha. Aye. Samale. Anna Marubes Capratilla Tadius. Shalia Ben Amarabasia Teladia. Rakus ke pratines, eshalamela, eshalamela, entala barado 
Oso Pratala Iranade Iarabasi. Shalom, Barate Sadai. Ila Kubernata Dradiko Paratias. Sasso Protogra Teledegades. Shalom, Baraba Baraba Teledegades. something we have not done since we started the 40 days the Holy Spirit brought it to my attention right now keep playing keep playing we're not dropping the momentum I'll give us the next few minutes begin to talk to the Lord right now on your own whatever you need whatever you've been asking the Lord for the moment I tell them to begin to pray you crank that thing up and we'll begin to go I want us just few minutes i'll give us just a few minutes for that your family's expectation your personal request you begin to lay them before the father the lord says produce your strong reasons you are going before the judge to win a case that's all i'll tell you that's all i'll tell you for the next few minutes let's go for the next few minutes approach the father and you begin to talk to him you begin to pray right now Shane Madila Cabratilis, Rakusha de Bellatia Lanius, Ambranota Lataba Irakuske de Latia, Arochate Baranela, Iso Cotone. You watching me online do likewise. Ay, uh, yes, do the same thing. Do the same thing. It's a best in a time, so you don't have to scream. That's why I ask them to even raise the sound. Nobody will hear you. It's between you and your father. Begin to lay your petitions. Begin to produce your strong with reasons you have to win that case right now yes kabarabo shot abilities anto merakus complete la dive ale shala kabania endorokos complete la irakus complete la tamea don't say but i've asked too many times ask it one more time ask it one more time it doesn't matter how many times you've asked in the past do it now that was the instruction he gave he said you've not done this since the beginning of 40 days he said do it now your personal request yes thank you labo shata gratilis aradie to me aradabalia temelea akusha tabalada aratoya A few more minutes, few more minutes, few more minutes. And the melody. He says, Ask, and it shall be given unto you. He says, He that oh, you have not received because you have not yet asked. He said, Ask that your man judge barada. He said, Ask so that your joy will be full. Nothing in this world will satisfy. Yes, keep on asking. Yes. Jesus. That won't run dry. Your presence is heaven to me. Ay, kamoradela, andoradiski sate. 
Lebosane. Your request are not being made to man. It's to God. He hears you from your heart. From your heart. Open up your heart and tell him. Open up your heart and tell him, Lord, this is it. I've come again today. This is it. Shale kopre metela taladies, anka baradus kopre telemena ne. Shali baradus oveladies, rakume kataradine sevelades. Anto mela baradoba shadi eberata. Anko borotes koso pretelada. Yes, yes, yes. Labo shiverates. Anka ni latobes. Oh, we thank you. You say when we ask, we will receive. When we ask, we will receive. That's what you said. We stand upon the power of your word, the efficacy of your word. And we begin to ask today in the name of Jesus. Yes, concerning yourself, your spouse, your children, your family, the church. Put in a request now. Put in a request now. The hands of the Father is open to receive. He's open to receive your request and to bless you. It's open. Even my instrumentalists, please make sure you're asking. Don't be left out. As you are playing, ask God for something. Asking for something. La robo sombra kilatania. Very few. We have a few more minutes more. Few more minutes. Ah yeah. Sare kene me tala na radies. Shado gradi kapala dies. Oh Jesus. Your presence is heaven to me, oh Jesus, oh Jesus. Your presence is heaven. To tell him, me. tell him, tell him. Yes, tell him. Everyone, tell him. Oh Jesus. Your presence is heaven to me, oh Jesus, oh Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we'll pray. I join my faith with yours. The Bible says, too, if two shall agree, as to touching anything it shall be done for them individually as you are i join my faith with all of you to become your two i agree with what you've asked the father for and i pray that the father will grant it to you Amen. in the name of jesus Amen. including you watching us online whatever you've asked as long as it's in line with the will of god for your life so shall it be in jesus name hallelujah hallelujah praise the lord please you may have your seat i want to thank all of you again i know it is not easy i'm not going to stand here and lie <laughs> <laughs> Go easy. <laughs> it's not. 40 days is not for the faint of heart. It's not for the weak. It's not. Uh, in case, let me just quickly add this. In case you've not been fasting, at least break 12 is okay. Fast. Because Jesus said, This type goes not except by prayer and. So make sure you fast. I will not, I will, no, no, I will, I'm not doing plain, I'm not doing daddy today. Daddy will tell you, eh, he's, no, me, I will tell you fast. You know, daddy's our father. He has, he has a, uh, me, I'm still young. My blood is still hot. No, even if it's to 12, except you, ha, you are not feeling well, you have to take medication. Or maybe for those that are pregnant or those who don't have any age yet, so no, don't worry. For, the, for you watching online, if you're, if you're, if you're aged, of course, uh, my hands are up. <laughs> Babani, eh? 
anyways glory to god but the rest of us even if it's till 12 fast okay it's important especially for the next phase we are going into from next week we are going into warfare okay some demons you cannot cast them out with food in your tummy uh, was it not devil that we could not cast out when jesus made that comment uh -uh. I'm, it's not joke oh. it's not joke i'm not trying to be funny it's for real that is why you see ministers fast a lot we are we have to fast so that a small it's epilepsy oh. epilepsy that my father that did not okay that had not given his life to christ before will go to the bush and pluck leaf and flush out epilepsy Jesus' disciples could not cast that demon of epilepsy. Juju man, juju man, we use leave, leave to chase it. Not one, not twice, I've seen it. Not once, not twice. After I finish with them, they'll take them to the hospital. Mafia, they're okay. No more attacks. I'm not joking. Several. That man is a healing minister. <laughs> but he didn't know he was doing it through the wrong means. Hallelujah. Please fast, okay? I don't know. This, uh, believe me, sir, it was not on my list. So I believe the Lord is drawing our attention to it. It was not on my list. Nothing for me to talk about. But I just had to let us know. Fast, even if it's the 12, okay? Then you go and look, hide, go somewhere, and eat. Don't let the other people catch you. <laughs> just. <laughs> well, just go and hide somewhere, break your fast, say, Lord, this is where my strength can take me. Lord, increase my strength, but I'm breaking here today. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Yeah, you come to church and do the other prayers. No, I will not tell you you have to do six to six. No. And some of you need to break before you come for prayer. Because mm, some of them say, well, let us pray. No energy in the reserve. I'm serious, I'm serious, I'm serious. There are days where, especially the days I know, walk, 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 walk. I am tired. Bodily. Spirit cannot be tired. Uh, you need uh, a hansa called uh, uh, Uncle Coffee. Uh, you know what I mean? To enhance the... So you cannot come to church and be... Why they are leading prayer? So if, if you need to break before coming, break. Don't say I must, I must do this to this. What's the point of fasting? You come to church, you cannot pray. It's a wasted time. All right? Don't be diplomatic with God. Are we together? Yes, sir. He's your father. He loves you. Too so much. Too much. Are we together? Yes, sir. So, please. The reason why I'm pushing on this is the instruction is 40 days fasting and prayer. Let's not be disobedient. Uh, just to get that one thing <laughs> anyways as i was saying as i was saying if there is prayer there is fasting right if we say husband and wife wife and husband Bible say the two of them become one so i don't know why my pastor is okay now you will come and tell us the difference now get him a microphone hallelujah <laughs> to free yourself from being disobedient okay try i know it's not easy but try my recommendation if you can, if you're like uh, what i used to be break by 12. <laughs> i've repented hallelujah yesterday we looked at what <laughs> we looked at what yesterday you forget <laughs> he was looking at me like man of god man of god I will not forgive you. <laughs> Hallelujah. Of course I will forgive. <laughs> he did never allow me to give punishment first. He said you will forgive. <laughs> I will forgive. Hallelujah. Forgive unforgiveness and bitterness. We looked at yesterday. Please, these are not just what we used to while away. No. There are more, but I'm not going to go because I mean from sunday next week it's a new di new dimension so we'll wrap it up today but please take time to look through these things they are very important one last one we're looking at today oh wow is sometimes very common amongst you know people both christians and all 
all right and that is what lie yes it's a terrible thing it's a terrible thing and we have to <laughs> sir <laughs> okay they don't call it lies anymore it's not format <laughs> ah lies from the pulpit to the pew lies everywhere it's terrible I'm telling you it is terrible but Paul it's terrible I was listening to somebody one time when he said the minister he was ministering under we come to church and fake testimonies of how he healed these how he pray. and you gullible receiver you hear at home ah there's power in that church a lie it's scope oh my you said it too oh, i did not hear it from me <laughs> it's all scope to make people draw people's attention to the ministry there are lies on the pulpit and if we the leaders are like that what do we expect from the people hallelujah but i want to say this every one of us have had opportunity to lie some lie today some lie before coming to church uh, if you have lied inside the church yours is serious though. it's very serious you lie inside church and tell you that I'm fine. You know you're not fine. You've lied inside church. Hallelujah. Proverbs chapter 6, verse 9, um, 16 to 19. Proverbs 6, 16 to 19. It says there are six things that the Lord hates and cannot tolerate. No, give me. Aha. Yet seven. What happened to good news? Where did he put the seven? Oh, did I not read it? Was it there? Uh, take it back. There are seven things. Oh, back to my... Shukra, my brother. Thank you. There are six things the Lord hates. Yes, seven. We forgot one before. He said, yes, seven. What are they? He said, these seven things are an abomination to him. Number one, let's go. A proud look. We've dealt with pride. Is that correct? And I was correct. I told you God hates it. Number two. Uh, you don't want to read. You know, over exaggerating is lie. You want to make the story tough. You want to make it sweet. You've lied. It's a lie. Yo. It's a lie. When something is too. Ah, some people. Ah, they lie a lot. Just to escape things. They lie a lot. All right, eyes that are arrogant, a tongue that lies, hands that murder the innocent. My God. I hope there's no murder in the house. But if there is, repent, God will forgive you. A heart that divides. I told you of these people. These people, they don't talk. They don't talk. They can sit down and plan three season, 21 episode season movie in their mind. You just mash them up. They've acted, they've acted three season film. Each season is 21 episode. They are divisive. Oh, Bible called them cunningly devices. And they said one of the attributes of the devil. Are we together? Yes, sir. God hates. All right. Feet that are swift. He <laughs> run into evil. <laughs> all right we'll stop at 19 this one a false witness that speaks lies i want to point this to you lies appears here how many times twice and one who sows discord among brethren e you know who these ones are gossips them say them say that's what we'll call them cho 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 you pick here, you plant here, pick here, you plant here, you marinate everything together. When a problem comes, you want to go away. God hates lies. Alright? Bible says it is an abomination. 
unto God. You know some people, their default setting is lie. They don't think before they lie anymore. They are so, I'm serious, so used to it that it's so easy. Now that they are trying to change, it becomes a problem. They still find themselves lie because it has been a default. The Lord will reset your system. Amen. And I'm serious. It's a terrible thing when somebody catches you lying. How you feel so ashamed? Like the rat beaten by rain. All the hair everywhere. Yes. Brothers and sisters, this is important. Stop lying. Listen, we are all of age. You know what I normally say? This is, this is what I normally do. What can, you go beat me. So I will tell you the truth. You don't go beat me. I mean, the highest you go get, you get angry. Then we'll discuss it and move past it. Instead of me lying or pretending, I'll tell you the way it is. Are we together? And I'm not saying I'm always correct. I could be wrong. You see where we're getting at? Stop pretending. Stop lying. Lie. God sees your heart. God sees your heart. Hmm. Proverbs 19, 9. 19 verse 9. 19 9. A false witness will not go unpunished, and the one who speaks lies shall perish. Oh, oh, hellfire straight. Have you heard of this statement? If you lie, you fry. Yeah, I used to tell my students in school if there's a problem, what happened? The one, if you lie, you fry. Mr. What does that mean? Meaning, if you lie, you will go to hell. They will tell you the truth. As arrogant as they are, they don't, they, they still like heaven more than hell. They don't like hell. <laughs> those children they don't like it hallelujah why did that statement come bible says for all liars shall find their place where in the lake of fire it's not something you should joke with oh. lying will take you to hell is it i'm telling you is an express way to hell and i'll show you why i'll show you why psalms chapter 101 verse 7 I'll show us later, not now. Psalm 101 verse 7. Okay. He says, he who walks deceit shall not dwell within my house. Can you see that? A deceptive person is at risk of making heaven. He says, shall not dwell within my house. He who tells lies shall not continue in my presence. Either the presence here on earth or his presence in heaven. Church, are we together? Yes, sir. Your lying tongue might just be the reason why things are not working yet for you, as they should. And God is bringing this to our attention today. And say, get yourself away from it. I told you before, the quickest lie is the lie of, I'm okay. I'm okay. And you have good reason to say that because you are trying to avoid conflict. You are trying to avoid argument. And then you lie. And you say, God understands. God does not understand lie. Never ever make that statement again. God understand it's a lie. Are you following me? Church, are you following me? Yes, sir. Please. Please and please. Get rid of lies. Speak the truth always. The highest they will do is to sack you, deport you. They're not faking you. Then what is it? No, no, I'm, I'm thinking because it takes, listen, why do people lie? Have you ever asked yourself that? Why do people lie? Why do people lie? Huh? Church, talk to me. Pastor uh, Kayode, thank you. It's the noise maker in class that they ask questions first. Tell me, why do people lie? I, you were talking, huh? Brad Davis, number two. When you finish answering, we answer. To cover up. You see? You're so correct. There's something to cover up. So you have to lie. And for you to sustain that lie, you must tell. Now you are now in a series of lies. Basha. Yes, sir. <laughs> Hallelujah. Say, I refuse to tell lies. Can I say something more? 
Some people forge document. It's a lie. <laughs> Pastor Ken, mind your business. I, I said I would preach the truth. Is that not what I said? Yeah. Mm -hmm. First Kings chapter 22, verse 21. Let's just move forward. <laughs> hey, all of us have one way or the other tell lies. You are looking for visa. Sir? Professional lie, the lounge, your CV. Did you hear this man? Say, come. <laughs> let me, let me, let me focus. We, past, we don't have time. We, we, we'll argue that one tomorrow. Eh? If it's not the truth, it's still a lie. I know, but it's still a lie. I know we have names for them. But a lie is a lie. Okay? I understand that. I understand that, like, like what you just said now, you know, due to your, the, the nature of your job, there are some things you are bound to do. You get, you get what I'm saying? It still doesn't make it right. I know. I just said it. It's a lie. It doesn't make it right. You had to do it because of the job, but it is still a lie. So you are lying to collect money. Lying to get paid. <laughs> Oh uh, no. <laughs> and another thing I want us to see here is there's something called the spirit of lie. It's called actually a lying spirit. Okay? Then a spirit came forward and stood before the Lord. This was in the presence of the Lord and said, I'll we persuade him. One of the reasons why people lie also is to try and persuade. I want to convince you. Amen, lie, oh. We may. We lie, oh. Especially when we are toasting. We lie, oh. Eh, eh, eh. Eh, but you lie to your wife. Your lady, now wife. Oh, this has passed away. <laughs> okay, for the sisters not yet married. Men can lie, oh. For the married ones, we've passed that stage. I told you I promised my wife the whole world. I will still give it to her. That one is not a lie. That one is a prophecy. I will still do it. I would. Yes. <laughs> no, no. I said I should not give you the word. I said I would take you around the world. And the promise is still there. The promise is still there. I will. Basha. You know my private jet, right? Thank you. Hallelujah. Then look out. <laughs> look at the next thing, 22. Let's go, 22. 22 said what? <laughs> and the Lord said, in what way? So he said, I will go out and be a lying spirit. Some people cannot tell the truth. Not them. They finish lying and they realize, ah, why, why, why did I tell this lie? Most cases, they are controlled by spirits. It's true. It's true. It's true. So part of the things we're going to be praying today, if there be any lying spirit in me, Father, I cast it out. Because the one that tells lies cannot stand in the presence of the Father. It, see, it's a very common sin to man, but very, very hated by God. Lie, bearing false witness, God hates it. That is why the devil has made it so common. You know what they have? They have something called call white lie. Thank God, that is the only one. No, uh, well, it's the only negativity not associated to black. Mm, not black lie, it's white lie. They say if you tell a little lie, they call it white lie. My brother, lie is a lie. <laughs> All lie is what? Lie. White lie. Go to hell. Thank you. Oto. Pastor okay, K, sorry. <laughs> Second Chronicles. Your company need. Second Chronicles chapter 18, verse 21. <laughs> he he shouted, it's not only me. <laughs> I'm enjoying today. I'm enjoying. <laughs> I'm enjoying today. Speak the truth. Most times it might hurt you. 
but in most cases God uses it to kill pride and ego do you know that speak the truth at all time if you do it so much you will start to live a certain life whereby you don't even need to lie to anyone and have nothing to hide you see these secretive people, people that are very secretive there are people that have tendencies to lie because nobody knew anything about them but when you are an open book if you say something there's somebody to confirm it there you see what I'm saying so he said I will go out the same scripture I will go out to be sorry and be a lying spirit in the mouth of the prophet and the Lord endorsed it and the Lord said you will persuade him and also prevail go out and do so every lying spirit operating in our lives today they will leave and never come back again Amen. I want to show you one reason why God hates lies John chapter 8 verse 44 he does not come from God say after me everybody say after me say I have nothing, I have nothing. except what God gives me God yeah God does not give lie is that correct I want to show you the foundation you are of your father the devil okay I want to read because I'm reading to my church people and those watching the line they are of their father the, the, you are not you are of God say I'm of God says they are of their father the devil I and the desires of their father they want to do watch this what was he a murderer from the beginning and does not stand in truth because there is no truth in him when he speaks a lie he speaks from his own resources for he is a liar and the father of lies oh 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 so anytime you lie you are telling god that your father is the devil it's just it, it's mathematics it, another equation truth equals god lie equals devil you are here if you tell lies child of the devil straight up simple math simple equation y equals mx plus b simple equation this one ah that's easy that's the bad always always haunting me every time <laughs> hallelujah so lying is of the devil it is it's not of god only children only kids should put themselves in a place where they lie because they don't want you to beat them because of fear it's true it's true every time i catch it i, I sit you down before i give it we must talk first i explain to you not only because of what you did i'm going to beat you but you lie lie you will go to do you want to go to it no i want to go to heaven but i'll have to flog you first <laughs> because you have lied lying is wrong so that they will understand the wrong that they've done teach this student to understand that lying is, don't just say hey it's not done like no it's something you should not condone are we together yes, sir. you can teach them from young age anytime they lie don't just correct them at fast mm -mm, mm -mm. stop whatever you are doing stop it you don't really have to hit them no stop all you are doing take a few minutes give them attention this is a lie and lying is not good everyone that lies will go to hell and they will die do you want to do that no you want to go to heaven stop telling lies you, we are not children stand and tell the truth they might not like you but you've told the truth are you following me they might not like you but god likes you again you think i care who do you think matters most <laughs> baba god do i care about what he thinks of me not what men i'm not perfect that's why i'm a man are we together yes, i've made mistakes well like jesus said if you are perfect throw your first stone uh, nobody don't stole me yet so none of us are perfect right thank you revelations 21 verse 8 last one before we pray revelations 21 8 speak the truth it might hurt it might hurt like i said but stand for the truth don't lie don't pretend uh, let's just uh, we'll forget let's just no no 
speak the truth someone hurt you don't cover it up not what i will tell you is before you speak make sure you are not angry get rid of anger speak about it because if i do something to brad dave and he's offended and he doesn't tell me i will not know that that thing offends him i might repeat it again are you following me that is why it's important you speak. You don't just cover it and say, hey, don't finish. No, no, no. no. This is what you did. I didn't. Let's let, try to explain. Okay, I appreciate your explanation. But I just want to clear it out of my mind. This, 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 this. So that next time when they are operating with you, they will not cross that line. It's just what it is. Are we together? Yes, sir. Speak up. Speak out. Don't lie. Don't pretend. He says, but the cowardly, unbelieving, abomination, uh, sorry, abominable, murderers, sexually immoral, sorcerers, idolaters, and all, including the white ones. Including white, black, pink, green light, it doesn't matter. All liars shall have their part in the lake which burns with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. Lord, it's the company that told me to lie. Mm. <laughs> the cowardly cowards will go to hello. But what it means here is those that deny Christ in the earth that are not bold enough to preach the gospel. They are cowards. But that's what I'm going to get into. Unbelieving. Not my level. You know the unbelieving, right? Those are not Christians. Yeah, there might be religious people. I don't want to mention names. Abominable, abominable, gay, homo, gay, abominable, and many others. All of the LGBTQ plus Q W X Y Z, all of them, abominable. Murderers, murderers is not only when you kill physically. Those that slander people. Bible says if you slander, speak evil against you, you have murdered them. Ah. Hey, fire go plenty. Oh. Go full. Oh, no, we are not there. We are not there. Sexual immoral ah, is increasing today. Sorcerers, idolaters, and all liars. Brothers and sisters, those that lie have one destination. It's hell. Where do you want to go? Choose ye this day where you will end up. Heaven or hell? I choose heaven. I choose heaven. I choose heaven. Right there where you are seated, bow your heads. Before you stand up, just where you are seated, bow your heads. Say, Father, forgive me of every sin of lie I have committed. I know I have lied. Some, you have to say, I know I'm a liar. Because for some, it's consistent. Ask him, including you, sir. Yalla. Yes, everybody, every, including me, I will drop my microphone too. Everyone, right there where we are, Lord, forgive me. Just talk to him. Sorry, man. Lord, I ask for your mercy. Oh, let me tell Ask for mercy and receive it from every lies you've told. Either you over exaggerate or you told the truth but you didn't complete it. You told it halfway and kept it in many one. You've, you, you did not tell the full truth. That is still a lie. That is still a lie. Talk to the Lord. Say, Lord, have mercy on me. I confess my sin today, being a sinner. Whether you lie to cover up something, you lie because you are angry, whether you lie to abstain from whatever the lie may be, it doesn't matter. Bible says for all liars will find themselves in the lake of fire. They have a place prepared for them in the lake of fire. Not in hell, in the lake of fire. Because the Bible says both hell and death will be cast into the lake of fire. The final destination is the lake of fire. These are the people that were born eternally in, in, in the lake of fire ask him right quickly before we rise up our time is up already just do that quickly lord we ask today in the name of jesus for your mercy your mercy have mercy upon me in jesus name we pray rise up on your feet as we begin to pray now one begin to pray now against every spirit of lie 
that is walking in you we command them to be silenced and we cast them out in the name of jesus turn out to your prayers quickly before we go quickly lord if there be any spirit of lie in my heart in my life i ask for your help lord right now i silence those voices and i cast out those devils in the name of jesus please make sure you do that the bible says in his name we will cast out devils when you cast out devils you are exercising authority you don't talk small you don't talk slow when you are driving that devil's authority i cast you out in the name of jesus yes you are you are you are commanding a spirit to leave you you don't do it psychedelically no 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 you speak with authority every lying spirit assigned to mislead me assigned to mislead me lord i cast them out today i silence that voice i drive them out of my life in the name of jesus use the authority in the name you will say in the name of jesus christ i drive out every spirit of lies every lying spirit that is assigned to my life lord to, to mislead me i drive them out in the name of jesus say lying has no place in my life lying has no place in me from from today i'll speak the truth at all times from today i'll speak the truth at all times it might hurt me it might hurt the people i'm speaking to but lord the intention is to stand for the truth lord help me to speak the truth in love to speak the truth in humility but to speak the truth i will not speak the lie i won't tell lies to cover up anything i won't tell lies just because i'm trying to avoid anything i will speak the truth so every spirit in me every 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 spirit misleading me speaking lies to me i silence you and i cast you out in the name of jesus then i want us to begin to pray every mechanism of my heart that is programmed to lie i destroy the foundation every programming of lie in my system i destroy the foundation no more no more in the name of jesus please quickly we are almost done we are almost done quickly quickly i come against every program every program why did i say that for some people it's not a spirit they've lied so much their mind has been set to lies every programming of lie in my system i cast you out i cast you out in the name of jesus i cast you out in the name of jesus the last one we're going to pray for today i declare i am free from the power of lying tongue from the power of a lying tongue i am free in the name of jesus and i begin to walk in truth of your word i begin to walk in truth of your word in the name of jesus yes pray, pray, pray. i decree and i declare that i am free i am free from the power of a lying tongue i am free from the power of a lying tongue i am free in the name of jesus do me one favor before we close turn to somebody point at them don't hold hands point at them say i declare and declare that you are free from the power of a lying tongue from today you begin to walk in the truth of god's word turn to your prayers in the name of jesus i decree and i declare by the power of god's spirit that you are free from the power of a lying tongue every spirit of a lying tongue power of a lying tongue that is manifested in you i decree today you are free who the son of man set free is free indeed you are free in the name of jesus you are free in the name of jesus you are free you will
will speak the truth at all times. You will no longer lie. I break. I break every siege of lie. Every siege of lie over you. I command it be broken in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Father, we thank you. Yes, keep playing that. Thank you. We bless your name. We thank you for that which you've done. Glory to your name. Our heart and our mind is turned towards you, Father. Precious Holy Spirit, by your Spirit in us, dear Father, by your Spirit in us, we ask today that you always help us to stand for the truth Amen. and speak the truth. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The settings before now. <clears throat> that accommodated lies. That setting has been reset today. Amen. I'm talking about your heart, your mind. I'm talking about your spirit and your system. It is reset today. Amen. And lie has been removed. Amen. You will speak the truth at all time. Amen. Speaking the truth in love and in humility Amen. thank you dear father lord we want to specially thank you for this for the second session of this 40 days you've been with us you've taught us a lot to get rid of fear to get rid of anger disobedience pride unforgiveness bitterness and lies lord all these you have led us i pray dear master these are not just prayer points. Let this become our lifestyle in the new covenant church, Qatar. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. When anyone that carries such spirit comes in, Lord, the word of God and the atmosphere you've given to us, we wash it away from them. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Our heart is for you. Amen. And we think every day, Lord, how do we become like you? Help us, dear Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you, Abba Father. For in Jesus, mighty name we pray. I say a word quickly for the meeting of tomorrow. Dear Heavenly Father, it is a success. In the name of Jesus, you will gather your sons and your daughters in. And you will bless them. And I also pray for every member of the New Covenant Church. Whether they are driving their cars or are in taxis or Ubers. I decree and declare no accidents. In the name of Jesus. You foul devil of darkness, seeking for God's people's life and their blood, you will not find anyone in NCC. Amen. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. Amen. I decree today that all through this fasting and all through this year, we are exempted from accidents. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Thank you for the testimonies that are coming. Blessed be to your holy name. For in Jesus, mighty name we pray. Amen. The best things of life. I like that. The best things of life. They are mine. Great opportunities. Great men and women. Money. Finances. Flowing to me. On every side. Through multiple streams. I lack nothing good. The doors of opportunities are open unto me. The grace for finances are activated upon my life. Thank you, precious Father. In Jesus' name. Bless the Lord. The meeting is over.